Um, well, hello, uh, hello, video diary. Um, we've had a short break um, in rehearsals, obviously, um, and now we've come back to it. And um, it's kind of funny in a way because I suppose in the break I had some moments when I felt really kind of like. Uh, I suppose anticlimactic in a way, kind of disconnected, because we ended the last period of rehearsals on such a high. You know, I was so motivated, and every minute, every day seemed to weigh, you know, more ounces than, than the last way in, if you know what I mean. And then suddenly, um, the break just, I just really rocketed downwards and, and really kind of missed the creative force of Sean Ed, really. And then then now we're back in rehearsal, it's all there again, you know, it's just amazing. And, and she's come in with these ideas um, about structuring the rehearsal room, you know, and she's been really on it. She's been like saying, okay, um, this is what we're going to do for the first half an hour, and then after the first half an hour, from, you know, minute 30 to minute 45, we're going to do this, and then we're going to do that, and then we're going to do this, and that means we've got 235 minutes a day to actually make the show, and all the other stuff is just, you know, it's just brilliant. She's organised it all, I mean... And she's kind of this kind of she's got this kind of model idea of what creates creativity and and what needs to be fed into the process so they are maximising you know your punch really and it's just you know she's blowing my head off I mean she's just she's really sharpening up the whole process because obviously you know one thing I kind of forgot to kind of you know really kind of I suppose take on board was you know as you approach your the performance date you know the first day that we're going to be playing the show in front of a public then obviously the pressure kind of mountain away and uh, I suppose I've never really kind of come to you know never really considered that before